it's strange. It's not what I'm used to. <laughs> what three-year-old put the lyrics and song together? So today we're going to be showing you a series of music videos that are all part of a music genre called grime. Grime. The name sounds <laughs> kind of rough, maybe a little more on the metal side. Why would you call something grime unless it denotes something dirty? It isn't a positive thing. It isn't like happiness, wonderful. It's more of a negative con connotation. This is just a small sampling today, but we may cover more artists in the future. Ready to jump in? Okay, why not? Can't try to say he's better than me. Tell my man shut up. Shut, shut up. up. Mention my name in your tweets. I rule by shut up. Shut up. Shut up is definitely not an American accent. Shut and shut with up. an accent. It's almost British. I like his presentation. I like this. I got a mob like ASAP Rocky. It's, to me, that's rap. It makes me think about rap. They will deep, I will swally. Got about 25 dudes in my posse. They drink babies, I drink posse. I get murky. This guy's cool. It's positive. It's not what I thought it would be. Why? Because I ain't won a mobile before. I guess they're his chorus. More wholesome compared to some of the other rap. <laughs> you forgot the words! He is so at ease with the camera and with his friends there. There's a lot of love there. Well, that was much better than I thought it would be. I'm so glad I'm not young anymore to listen to whatever this is. So that comes from Stormzy. He got enough attention from this freestyle video, which was released on YouTube, to eventually release a professional track of this song that charted. Oh, okay. I relate freestyle more to dance. I thought all rap was freestyle. On the spot poetry, like slam poetry. Did you find what he was doing in the video impressive enough to have a professional track made from it? <laughs> Not really. My standard was a little higher than that. Yeah, it was impressive. It was definitely very talented. When it shut down, that's not me and it shut down. Ring, ring, boy, it shut down. Hey. Fashion week and it shut down. Went to the show. What makes grime different from rap? Sort of like a group rap is what I'm getting out of this. Take time if a man want to try me. No time. You, you could really dance to this. It's, it's strange. It's not what I'm used to. When I get through, I'm going to bring Okay, well, this is, uh, I've heard a hundred of them like this. I don't know exactly what they're saying. Maybe the message isn't for me. I was in Paris, shut down lock. See, see, yeah, uh, yeah, no, 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 no. Look at the body language. Angry, defiant. They look too gangly. No label, no A list songs, and I told them. Interesting. But I kind of gather this one also was not made in the United States. It sounds like it was made in Great Britain. A lot of violence and encouraging that kind of attitude. There's a meanness, a hatred. Um, it's scary. So this song comes from Skepta. He's a key figure in the emergence of grime. Skepta has been praised for his anti-mainstream message. He left his record label to produce music independently so he can do it on his own terms. Oh, everybody's gonna be praised for that. In fact, it's so way to go, it's becoming the mainstream. Would artists do something like this back when you were growing up or was there no like way to become popular without the aid of like radio and record companies. When I was growing up, there was no music like this. <laughs> it was always who who do you know? And did you have some kind of music or rhythm that was different from everybody else? I don't think they could get any of their music out without record label and the DJs. There was no way to become popular unless you made it big. This is very encouraging because young people can do it. I think it's wonderful. They know that we savages know that we call. We come from the road. I see, this is pretty cool. They all sound the same. <laughs> you look like you're playing. You got toys and you got a gal there. I wish I had his body. Why he's got a nice body? This guy's a stud, though. No boys in my section. He's got the jewelry that. Nothing but cocoa with Diamonds, the cars, the chicks. Boys in my section. Don't like that. Don't like that at all. This is more materialistic type of music. I like the beat. It's all that you should want bling, cars, jewelry, sex. I mean, come on. What three-year-old put the lyrics and song together? What are they so angry about? 
you know, why couldn't they just sing a pleasant song? The machine gun stuff I could probably do without, but you know, overall, the guy's a performer. He moves exceptionally well, fun to watch. So that was Bugsy Malone. He's one of the most successful independent British MCs. And being from Manchester, he's one of the few grime musicians who did not originate from London area where grime really started to merge. Bugsy has spoken about coming from an impoverished youth and spent some time in jail, but considers grime to be an outlet for him. Yeah, way out. It was a way out and he got lucky. What do you think about how music Music and creativity can at times turn people's lives around. Well, I think music can turn a pe person around. I don't know that this could. Any form of creative endeavor that would help a person recover from from something that bad that happened in their life, I, I think it's there is no price can be put on it. That's what gives them gives them the ideas. That's how they got the ideas to do it in the first place. They had these experiences that they're expressing through. Grime. Grime is a relatively new genre that started in London in the early 2000s. It's characterized by its heavy bass uh, and the double time rhythm and not produced to be what some would call commercially mainstream. Right. But some have said that grime is too similar to hip hop to be considered a new genre. From the hip hop and rap that you've listened to here or in your life before, are you able to notice the difference with grime? It's all the same to me. I couldn't tell you the real difference, but to me, it, it's very similar. It all sounded pretty much the same, except the ones that had a good beat you could dance to. Now that I like. It's got a slight difference with the lyric itself and with the performers. It's not hip hop and it's not rap, but it's close. Many say that grime music like initially spread through pirate radio stations, live performances, and like online outlets like YouTube before achieving like a mainstream recognition in the UK. For you growing up, how were new genres and like music discovered? Well, most of it was done on uh, record. Going to see live bands. I was going to see bands all the time. A lot of the artists became famous through church. That's where you got the blues and the jazz and, and so forth and the ballads. It came on the radio. I remember how difficult it was for people to get their music played on the radio. Now, you know, you have all these other outlets that you can go through. So finally, with grime being a relatively newer genre, there likely aren't too many elders on our cast or otherwise who are aware of it just yet. After today, do you think you'll tell your friends about grime music and become an ambassador of the genre? I doubt it because it's not my type of music. No. I, uh, I mean, from what I see, I, I, don't, I don't think it's worthwhile. My grandchildren, yeah. My, my children, yeah. But my generation, no. I probably won't become an ambassador of it, but uh, I would certainly listen to it if it came on. Takes you to a place where you haven't been before. There's adventure there, and who doesn't like adventure? Thanks for watching this episode of Elders Reacts. A shout out to Sophie Hargan. Subscribe if you want a shout out like Dougie's Life. Want a shout out like Bianca Garcia? Leave a comment below. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Elders React. Let us know in the comments if you have a favorite grime artist because we here at FBE just can't get enough of grime these days, and maybe it'll be in the next episode.